In celebration of National Pet Month, Wise Markets is hosting its 11th annual Pause for Pets program. This is your chance to support, to support local community animal shelters while enjoying shopping at Wise Markets. Here with more are Jamie Hynoski of Wise Markets and Wendy Goldband of the Baltimore Humane Society. Welcome, you two. Thank you. And you brought somebody else here. Who's this? Yes, this is Jazz. He is 12 years old and up for adoption. Jazz is very relaxed right now. I like that. He's a great dog. He's great. a really great dog. And you never know, he's already what we call senior. He just moves around. He does. Has fun. I yeah. saw him, yeah, before we started talking, before he started napping. But Wise Marcus is supporting various animal shelters this mm -hmm. month. Talk a little bit about this program. Sure. So Wise Markets this year, we are celebrating our 11th annual Paws for Pets um, program. And over the last 11 years, Wise Markets has collected over four, or I'm sorry, $2 million wow. for our Paws for Pets program. $2 and, million. Yes. And all of that went to local animal shelters um, in the communities where we serve. So how do customers participate in this program? What do they do? Um, customers have many ways that they can participate. Mm -hmm. So starting tomorrow mm -hmm. through May 29th, they can stop into a local store and they can start with um, it throughout the store, pick up any items um, throughout the store. Wendy could probably give some ideas on... The different items. Yes, that animal shelters are in need of. Um, ah. Pet food, kitty litter, um, toys, treats, um, cleaning supplies. So just as I'm there, I'm shopping for my home, I can also buy more pet supplies that a shelter could use and then what just donate them right on the spot yes there's a bin at the front of the store so they just drop them in there after checkout and then at yeah. checkout they also have the option to make a one three five dollar donation or they can round up their receipt to the next whole dollar amount round up the receipt that's very convenient yeah I, I really do like the idea of you're just sort of shopping around and say you know what let me pick this up as well and not having to make the extra step of dropping it off at a shelter that's great yes. so it's been happening now for 11 years more mm -hmm. than two million dollars raised why did WISE even want to get started with something like this to give back in this yes. regard? So it's a company-wide initiative, so we're doing this in all of our stores. Um, you know, it's something that we want the customers to be able to get involved with National Pet Month, mm -hmm. and um, this is a great way to do that. And um, it's a way that we can also give back to the communities and show that, that we are involved. And are there any other activities that are happening this month, Wendy, do you know of? Um, well, we typically have adoption events that we take part in, so mm -hmm. that's always wonderful. Mm -hmm. Pets like Jazz can Pets find like a good home. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. And then the, how are these um, donations going to help the shelters like throughout this time? Because I know that that's always an ongoing need. What Weiss does for us is absolutely wonderful. We are so thankful to them for letting us participate in this program because we don't get funding from the government or from any National Humane Society. So donations like these are what help us keep running and keep our doors open. I think that's a really important reminder because I think that people hear Humane Society and they think that there's some overarching entity that is sort of funneling money in or that, but you really do rely on these fundraisers, these drives. Absolutely. And the donations, the in-kind donations, the pet food, the pet treats, the cat for cats for the cats, for the dogs, um, the paper towels, the bleaches, yes. all of that we use all of it and yes. we can never get enough. Right. We also have a pet food bank, so the food can go into the pet food bank as well and help people who are who are hit upon hard times and can't afford to keep their pet otherwise. They wanna yeah, they wanna keep their pet healthy and, and safe right. and with them. All right, so people are gonna see this, they're gonna wanna participate, maybe even adopt Jazzy over here. Mm -hmm. um, how do they get involved? How do they make a donation? They just oh well there you go, there's information. I answer my own question. Go to wisemarkets.com. You can start doing this right now and it's happening the entire month. Um, yes. I'm also one of those people that likes to round up when I'm paying at checkout yes. so that's a good way to do it too. Thank you both so much for Thank being you. here. Really appreciate it. We'll be right back with more Midday Maryland right after this. Stay tuned.